Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. So getting straight into the tutorial, I'm going to moisturize my face. So when I was filming this, I was still a little bit unwell from a few weeks ago. So if you see me kind of breathing with my mouth open a lot, it's because my nose was completely blocked. So now I'm taking my face mask and I'm just popping this under my eyes just because they were really dehydrated, but I did end up using the mask later on. So now I'm taking my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer and I'm going to put this on my eyelids as an eyeshadow base. To set that base down, I'm just taking the yellow shade out of my Kat Von D Shade and Light palette and I'm just going to place this all over the lid. Now I'm taking this cool tone grey shadow as my transition colour and I'm going to place this in the crease and just kind of blend it out. So the eyeshadow today is not complicated at all, it's quite simple just because I am doing blue lips I want to keep the look quite subtle on the eyes and just kind of focus on the wing liner and the lips. So to deepen up the crease, I'm going to take a darker brown and just focus this directly in the crease line. Now I'm taking this cream coloured eyeshadow and I'm just going to pack this all over the lid. And for liner, I took one of the Too Faced Sketch Marker eyeliners, I think that's what it's called, and I took the navy colour and I just created a cat wing. So that's pretty much as symmetrical as I'm going to get my eyeliner. So now I'm going to go in with some mascara and coat my lashes, and then I'm going to go in with some falsies and just apply them and then we'll move on to the face. So for primer, I'm going to take my Benefit Professional Primer and just apply this to the T-zone area just to fill in my pores and kind of keep the makeup on longest on those areas just because I do have an oily T-zone. And for foundation, I'm taking my Marc Jacobs Remarkable Foundation and I'm just applying this with a stippling brush, which I don't usually do, but I thought I would try it out and I actually did really like it. I do have fake tan on, as you can see, so it does match my body. And for my concealer, I'm using my Essence Soft Touch Mousse Concealer and I really do like this concealer. If you've got the patience to actually sit there and really blend it out, it actually creates a really flawless finish. So I love it because it covers my under eye circle so well and it's so so cheap as well so I'm just highlighting under my eyes with it and my chin and also my forehead so now I'm taking this NARS face palette I'm not sure if it is limited edition but I'm taking the lighter shade out of that palette and I'm going to set my under eyes with it and also my forehead and my chin just kind of setting those highlighted areas And to set the rest of my face, I'm taking my Australis Fresh and Flawless Powder in the colour Darkest Brown. To bronze up my face, I'm taking the NARS Laguna Bronzer out of that palette and I'm just going to bronze up the outer perimeters of my face. And to contour, I'm going to use my Bahama Mama bronzer. I know it says it's a bronzer, but it's actually quite cool toned on my skin. So I'm using that to contour today. And I will link my nose contouring video down below because I don't show it in this video. And then after I've contoured my cheekbones, I'm just going to clean up the area with some banana powder. And then I'm taking this beautiful pink blush out of the palette and just applying this to my cheeks. For highlighter, I'm taking my Mary Luminizer Highlighter by The Balm and I'm just applying this to my cheekbones, on my cupid's bow and also on my temples. Mm. 
So to complete the eyes, I'm just using the same colours I used in my crease just to smoke it out. And then I'm going to take this Essence Liner and it is again a navy colour. And I'm going to tight line my eyes. Sorry, my face looks really gross in this frame. And then I'm also going to line my waterline only halfway in just so I don't close up my eyes too much. And then I'm just going to apply some mascara and then the eyes are all done. So for the fun part of this tutorial, I'm going to take one of the Too Faced Melted Matte Lipsticks and this is in the colour Who's Zooming Who and I really wanted to do a look with blue lips and I actually really loved how it turned out and I feel like I could actually wear this out and feel pretty confident in it. Honestly, I'm just really in love with this lip colour. So anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I'll see you guys very soon in my next one. Bye!